It's freaking He Man! Yoth Girth! Excuse me? Good morning, Brook Hollow. Today is October 20, 1990. This is your news. We have a special breaking report. The police department has released information that more local teenagers have gone missing. They were last seen earlier this week, and the only connection between the teenagers is that they are all students at Brook Hollow High School. This could be linked to the disturbing trend of other possible abductions and missing teenagers from our otherwise quiet town. Okay. If anyone has seen the teenagers or has any other information, please contact the police department. The mayor of Brook Hollow has this looks good. to effect for anyone under 18 starting tonight. Now to other news. Dude, it's so 90s. Am I seriously in a briefcase? Investigate surroundings. Uh, what? Damn. Where am I? Are those roots? Nah, <laughs> can't be. Oh God. This must be one of those, those prank TV shows. <laughs> All right, be cool, man. All right. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Grounded. I have never played Grounded in my entire life. Uh, I've been waiting for the game to be fully released. And uh, this is definitely giving me Honey, I Shrunk the Kid vibes. I remember watching that as a kid and be like, man, wouldn't it be cool to be an absolute midget? That's, what is that? Clogs now. Is that, a like that little red thing in for a fight. Oh boy. I'm not very good with bugs, I'll be completely honest, but we'll see what happens. Like up ahead. Holy crap, dude. This looks so cool actually. This is like first impressions, I'm not going to lie. This looks really cool. What is this? Oh, nap. Okay. I'm very excited to see. Oh, is this drinking water? Slurp nasty water. I'm assuming that would make me sick. Plant fiber. Mushrooms. Is this a run? Okay, there's run. But yeah, so we're gonna, I'm gonna play this. And uh, I'm live on Twitch. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, what is this? Oh my goodness. Oh, what? He's dead. It's a speedy little green corn puff. Okay. What was that? Some sort of radio signal? I wonder where it's coming from. All right, let's just run before I get eaten by a spider or something. So I'm basically a toy. Whoa, you've discovered f field station. Okay. Okay, what does any of this do? Ooh, candy bars. Safety test. Tully backyard, Dr. Welly. Weldon, T okay. Well, someone had to have set up all this sciencey stuff here. 
But still, I'm not exactly sure where this is and what is going on. I should keep looking around. Brain power unlock, analyze, common. Raw science points, okay. Uh, new recipes, to, okay, so we got a spring spike, okay. But yeah, so this is like, first time ever playing this, so, uh, I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just kind of looking at stuff, and I'm just gonna figure it out. Raw science, okay. Common mushroom spore. I don't know what any of this is for. Well, I had a battery now. Oh, is this the crafting stuff? I don't know what any of that is. Okay. Loco locate the source of the signal. Use the research analyst. Okay, I got it. Explore more science equipment. Offline. Eh, work. Eh, work. <laughs> it's not working. It's kind of cool. Is there like a third person view? I don't know if I can get in third person. Oh, what's this? Oh, you can cut the grass down. Find and eat some food. Okay. <gasps> it's a fly. You can swap between. Oh, it's you. Hey, there we go. There's my boy. I like this a lot better. Wow. What is that? <gasps> oh, what is this? I'm tiny. I was a fool. To have ever doubted myself. A fool like Klein, like Kaminsky, like Schmechter, like all of Ominent. I am here in the backyard. Down in the backyard. I mean, I am speaking to you from the backyard. Whoa. I am tiny. I should gather my thoughts. This is a momentous occasion. Wendell Tolley official log 89.08.05. Recording as I take my first steps into the miniature world. The sights are unbelievable. The textures, the, the way the light falls upon every surface. The patterns in all of the objects that surround me. <laughs> Just the like grass. laser tag. Nothing happened. Looks like the other two lasers are blocked. After all that build up, this big mysterious computer doesn't do anything. Man. Yeah, this... This is definitely gives me, um, Honey, I Shrunk the Kids vibes. Because, like, doesn't that look like the machine? Like, completely? Wait, you can go in here? Oh, oh, I hit C. Oh. Hello. So C is like a whole crafting. Okay. Alrighty. Should we try making some clothing? Ooh, look at all this stuff. Oh. I want to make, uh, I want to make, uh, I want to make this. I need more pebbles and I need rope. I like this. This, uh, this, the game's, uh, art style is kind of cutesy. Alright, so how do I do this again? Let me see. So I want to make rope. How do I craft this? Hot craft in in ingredient. Oh, okay, so you need whatever this is. Uh, craft. Cool. Can I craft this now? Nice. We should probably craft a spear. And we should probably craft one of these. I like how you can, like, click on it and craft. That's, like, a really nice feature. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, so we need two more rocks. We got a spear, though. And we got a... Whatever this is. Is this a hatchet? Now, this, this thing breaks rock. Oh. What's that? Oh. Oh, what the hell are you? You can block attacks with holding a weapon. Yeah, I got that. How do I get this? Okay. I'm really scared for stuff to attack me. Like that! What is that? Whoa, look at the size of that egg. Honestly, I'm just glad he's not big enough to squish me. Dude, this Max is taking his shrinking real, real, uh, what is it called? In stride. He's like, yeah, as long as I don't get stepped on, it's all good. Wow, that's a lot of rock. Oh, they tricked me. I thought it was going to be a lot of rocks. And now can we chop this down? <gasps> There's the water. Slurp no water. Crime, but... It's better than nothing. Okay, so we got water. Nice. Can I chop this all the way down? <gasps> I cut a piece of grass. Ooh, in this... Oh. Okay. I don't know what this is for, but I'm assuming this is for... Uh, this is for building a base. Okay. So we're gonna go over here. I don't know how I dropped it, but it works. Okay, I gotta, I gotta unblock this laser. Alright, 
Which one is it? It's uh this one. All right, all right. Find what's weakening in the other laser. Bruh, I feel like if I hit one of those, I'm gonna get super electrocuted. All right, so we gotta go to this laser over here. The graphics are pretty good. I, I give the graphics a, a, an A plus for sure. Sound design also is pretty good still as well. Uh, we'll see. Uh, we'll see what happens when we get into something. Ew. Ew. Oh my god, it's so nasty. Alright, we're going in, boys. Oh, it's dark. Oh, it's real dark. Ah! Jesus. Ah, 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 ah. Hold up. I need to... I Hold up. Craft a torch. Yeah, I need a torch. My first enemy is a flea. <gasps> What's that? What the hell are these? I don't really want to go down there. Yeah, we're not going down there. Uh, can I cut this down? Can this give me, um... Can this give me pieces that I need? Running, running, running. Jeez. Okay. All right, cool. All right. All right, we got it, boys. Let's go in. Okay. <gasps> Jeez. Die! Oh my god, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Craft a fiber bandage. What is a fiber bandage? Oh, this. How do I use it? How do I use it? How do I use it? What's my inventory? Uh, Which one is it? This. Unanalyzed, recover health. Okay. Eight. How much health does that give me? Wow, that really gives me nothing. Okay. Did I just see you can pick up the root? No, okay. All right, so we gotta go through here now. Picking up all my rocks. Hey, these are my rocks. I can, okay, so this is gonna be a pretty big survival gathering game. I can just tell this now. What the heck? Is something burrowing under there? Scabby, additional flavor scheme available. Our car is higher, higher level tool available. Okay. Okay. Certain resources require higher tool. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I got that. All right. Well, we're, we're, I guess we're getting out of here. Okay. All right. Did we fix everything? I think we did. Activate. <gasps> Cutscene. Oh. <laughs> what? Uh, did you hear something that sounded like a big far off explosion? 
Build a, a build a lean to? What the hell is a lean to? Oh, a lean to. Okay. Oh, okay. I like this. The tutorial is actually pretty good. I'm just gonna car harvest a bunch of this real quick. Build a lean to. All right. Do we want to build it? I kind of want to build it off the ground. Can I build it like up here? No, I can't. B Listen, I would build up here. I, I would build away from everything. All right, well, we're gonna place it right here for now. I'm assuming this is my respawn point, yeah? Let's see. I heard there's building in this game. Oh, and use. Caution, you'll wake up in the dark. Set as spawn. Spawn point has been set. Set your spawn point at your lean to. Okay, got it. You can use your respawn point by M. <gasps> oh, there is a map. Oh, look how big this wait actually this seems kind of tiny we've already explored all this it's probably bigger okay crafting status oh interesting this is good so far this is good the one complaint i have is you can't set up like a big server with people for this weevil all right the motive of my of my playthrough is if it doesn't if it doesn't mess with me i ain't messing with you all right well let's go to the oak tree real quick then tastes <gasps> good Damn, look at that dew water, eh? Where the hell is the tree? I actually can't read this. Where is the tree? What? Alright, I think I want to sleep. Uh... Oh god. Okay, this game's directions are gonna actually kill me. And yeah, we're playing, like, normal mode, so... It says you wake up in the dark? Bro, it's already turning dark! Oh my god! It's... Wait, what is this? Punch? Puncho? Bro, look at that delicious liquid up there of, of neutrons. I want it. Right side G to unload. Thank you. All right, I'm sleeping. I, I, it's our, it's, oh, it's a ladybug. Ladybug coming through. Oh, you're so cute. Food. <laughs> Sleep. I, I want to skip the night time. Oh. That wasn't eight hours. Oh. All right, oh. shadows. What you got now? Oh, this is terrifying. No, 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 no. I can't. I can't sleep. Oh my God. This is terrifying. This, 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 this is a horror movie. Set, it's set in place right now, boys. Okay. I need to go that way. So which way is that when I'm facing? That's the tree. Okay, so that's the tree. Is there a way? Oh, uh, place waypoint. Um, all right, let's go. This this is terrifying. Go 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 go. Oh, I'm not liking this. Oh, it's so scary. Okay, thank God there's a light. All right, we're close to something. Oh, is that an ant colony? Hello? Oh no 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 no! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I don't know why that just freaked the fuck. That just freaked me out. That freaked me out so bad. Oh no! Oh no 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 no! Oh, there's like a lot of flies. Ew! My little doohickey thing is going off. Acorn shell. I'm not picky. Hell nah. What is this? Slap clump. I'm gonna break it. Oh. Oh, bunch of sap things. My torch broke. My torch broke. My torch broke. No, they're sleeping. They're legitimately sleeping. Oh my god. No, 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 no. That is terrifying. Friggin' massive ass spiders Ugh. oh what the hell it's like a nuclear oh whoa dude it's a micro lab look at this this place is getting pinker by the minute Man, 
How do you how do you make this as a small person? Oh, an analyzer. Oh, look at all the stuff. Oh, look at all the cool things I can make. Spinning wheel. I don't know what any of this stuff is. Raw science. Where? MC equals 1R infinity. Color event space reduction. But not just space. Okay, so there's a big dude. Small dude. Big dude. Uh... Contains and cool. Can it be cooked? I don't know. I don't know what any of that means. <gasps> What's this? I have isolated the source of the particle irregularities. They appear to be a byproduct of the shrinking process. If I adjust the machine to account for their existence, it should be the key to the de shrinking, uh, expanding process. Burgle. Please bring up the readings for the irregular covalent SNPI 42Z particle traces. Ugh, that name is going to get tiresome. And while you're at it, rename all references to the irregular covalent SNPI 42Z particle to Raw Science. Order received. Raw Science identified. Does it require cooking, flipping, or grilling? No, 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 none of those. Categorization. That answer is not permitted, according to health code standards governing the handling of raw food items. What? If I can take, I will steal. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. All right. Warning. Air condition control. Okay. Oh, it's like a gun. Oh, I got your back. Give me a quick second. System reboot in progress. Oh my goodness. You Thanks are kind of cool. I am B -B 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 Burgle, acting science manager for this project. I am also a robot. I am sure this all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. I am sure this all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. I suspect you were miniaturized by Dr. Tully's spacer device. Why are you here in the yard? I do not know. In fact, I cannot seem to recall much of anything. A recent power surge has caused a massive raw science containment explosion. This lab, as you can see, is a disaster. Yeah, you can say that again. And what's worse, the explosion has disrupted my computing power. My memory banks are corrupted. Sorry to pile on the bad news, my new friend. How can I be of service? It seems you and I are both a little discombobulated. Given my best calculations, your biomass has been subject to covalent spacing reduction via interatomic energy extraction. In what? other words, you have been shrunk. It is likely this was achieved using Dr. Wendell Tully's Spacer platform, patent pending. Shrinking can be a traumatic experience for tiny human brains, and memory loss is a known side effect. Hopefully your memory will return in time. Dr. Tully is a brilliant scientist and inventor. He is also my creator. My initial protocol was to serve as the short order cook of the future. <laughs> Short order cook of the future. However, I have been oh. recently promoted to acting science manager to assist with his experiments. No doubt my previous work experience has been invaluable to Dr. Tully. Although, now that I am processing it, I have not seen him for several weeks. And now I cannot recall where he went. It must be my c corrupted memory banks. You are here in the Oak Lab. Built and used by Dr. Wendell Tully to experiment on all things small. This is the base of operations for conducting experiments in his yard. Okay, how do I get the hell out of here? To return to your prior size, you would need to successfully activate Dr. Tully's spacer platform. Unfortunately, my readings indicate it is inoperable. It appears to have suffered several malfunctions from the explosion. I am sorry, but it appears you may be stranded here for some time until we find a solution. Oh, lovely. Haha! -ha! 
That is a great idea. Let me run a full diagnostic scan on it and see what we need to do to get it fixed up. Processing. Processing. Memory fault. Code 408B3000. Ominent OS script runtime error. Ah, uh, it's always with these damn robots. They full up on memory and then he can't do anything. Arg. I am sorry again. It appears I have sustained more damage to my memory chips than expected. Oh boy. Without those memories, I do not know how to repair the spacer. Dr. Tully used two types of chips to back up my memory. Auxiliary chips are small capacity chips used to store project data. If you find these, I should be able to help you learn new survival recipes. Super chips are special, and they are gold. They back up full directories of my memory system. Okay. If we are going to fix the spacer. That data is bound to be on a super chip. Super chip. I suggest exploring the other labs in the backyard. Return with any memory chips you find. Bro, I want to know how he built all these labs. Did he like... Did he like build most of the things like regular size and then shrink it down or like did he shrink it down and then build it like there's so many questions I want to know. Dr. Tully has built many more labs throughout the yard. Each lab is used for various experimental procedures. I can upload their locations to your scabby. Stand by processing. 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 Error. Files not found. Code 632C404. Oh my god, dude, this robot's useless. Cheese and fries. The lab locations are missing from my memory banks, too. Oh my god, what another thug. But we are in luck. I was able to retrieve the location of one of the facilities, the Hedge Lab. The Hedge Lab is the observation center of the yard and used for research on arachnid webbing. You will find the hedge near the house if you head southeast. The lab is located deep inside the hedge. Sending the coordinates to your scabby. Alright, well that was- Try to find the hedge lab first. But there is nothing stopping you from searching the yard for the other labs. Except, of course, thousands of angry, hungry insects. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me. Dr. Tully locks the important labs with biometric scanners. You will need access for any chance of success. Head over to the ASL terminal and place your hand on the biometric scanner near it. Give it a moment to sync your signature into the mainframe. Okay. Once you are registered, you will be granted access to the ASL network of computers too. Okay. ASL grants access to daily work items. Nay, tasks. Nay, quests. Yes, quests. I will reward you raw science for each completed quest. Raw science for quest. In my science shop, you can trade raw science back for survival recipes from experiments that Wendell conducted when he was first exploring the yard. Okay. Log on to the ASL terminal over there and see what is available. Okay. Unless you have any other questions, you really should get started finding those ch chips and try not to die out there. Okay. Have an exponentially great day. Okay. You too. All right, I'm not gonna lie. That was a great tutorial explanation for a game I, I have no idea what I'm doing. That was like perfect. It explained basically the primitives of the story, what the goal of the story is, what I need to do, and now I have a premise of exactly uh, the whole gameplay of game, which is which is great. I think it, this is fantastic.